Hello again, this is Robert Veach here, and this is my video review of the iHealth brand, their COVID-19 antigen rapid test. There's two tests per pack here. This is FDA EUA authorized over-the-counter at at-home self-test. Results in 15 minutes with no invasive nasal swab, easy to use, no discomfort. Now I use this for myself and my wife back when we had a Thanksgiving event this year and I bought this again for a Christmas event that we're gonna have and everybody in my family has a kit so they're gonna test themselves before we get together so that we can enjoy being together with family. So this is FDA authorized, it's 15 minutes only and you don't need a lab to do this. It's uh, real simple to do, but it's a very specific set of instructions. Um, there's no discomfort on this because you don't have to go really high up in your nose. You just have to rotate the swab and do a rotation of the whole swab in your mouth, half inch, three quarters of an inch. And this will work for ages two and above. And um, really an excellent product to use. Now I'm gonna open this up but I'm not gonna open up the packages because I wanna make sure that we use this uh, right before our Christmas party, but I can show you what is in this kit, and I'm gonna have the video that is presented by on Amazon from the company, just showing you exactly how to use this. I edited that video, I took out all the fluff and all the jokes and everything, and so that it's shorter for you to watch, so that you're gonna get right to the point and see how to use this kit. Like, see it has a little seal on here so that you know it hasn't been tampered with. Let's open this up. There's the two vials that are gonna hold the liquid and your swab tests. So there's everything. There is step-by-step -step instruction in case you don't want to watch the video. Here is the two swabs that you're going to use inside each person's nose. Here is the test card in here. I can feel the test card right in there. And in here, it's included, there is the fluid. If you look close there, there's fluid right there. And that's in each one of these. And that's what's gonna have the reaction to when you put the, put these um, in your nose, you're gonna be putting these into these little canisters and squishing them out. This is real pliable. And that's what's gonna allow you to do this test. And then this is the actual COVID-19 test card. I'll show an image of that. And that's where you're gonna be putting the drop in and watching the results and see if you get a line on there. As they say, that line could be really small, really light, but you shouldn't see any line in that second position. First position, they'll explain, is just a test locator line. The second one is telling you whether you have COVID in your body or not. So, that's the basic kit. Watch the video or go through and follow the instructions right on here. Tear the foil packaging off your test card and lay the card upright so that it's ready to receive your test solution once you've taken a sample. Open the handle end of the swab package and pull out the swab. Be sure not to touch the swab end with your fingers or bring the swab into contact with any potentially germy surfaces. Swab as if you are cleaning the inside of your nose. Note that this is not a matter of simply twisting the swab in place. When you've finished, swab your other nostril the same way. Insert the swab all the way into the solution. Twist it back and forth in the solution at least 15 times. And as you're removing the swab from the tube, squeeze the sides of the tube to wring every last drop of delightful solution and sample out of that swab. Then replace the large lid back onto the tube. Now, let's test the sample. Remove the small dropper lid at the tip of your test tube and carefully squeeze three drops 
drops of solution into the receiving port on the test card. Set a timer for 15 minutes. You'll see your sample being slowly absorbed into the test strip. And over the next 15 minutes, your results will appear on the test strip as lines under the C and potentially the T. After 15 minutes, you can officially read the results of your test. But be aware, you only have another 15 minutes to read them before the results are officially considered invalid. It's a good idea to set another timer. Let's read your results. The C line is the control line. A line should always appear under the C. This tells you that the sample has been absorbed into the strip and that the test card is valid. If no line appears under the C, then the test card is invalid. If possible, you will need to test three drops of your sample on another card. The T line is the test line. A line will only appear under the T if you have tested positive for the virus. If there is no line under the T, then the test did not detect any virus in your sample. Nice! Be aware that depending on certain factors, such as how long the virus has been in your system, the line under the T may be very faint. Regardless of how light or dark, any line at all under the T means that you have tested positive for the virus. If you're unsure, you may wish to use a magnifying glass or hold the test card under a bright light for closer inspection. But as I said, I've used this kit before and it works really well and it's very simple to do and well worth the money for peace of mind. So I'm going to give this product a full five star rating. Please remember hit the subscribe button and the bell icon so you learn the new video uploads. And if you like this review, please hit the like button. I hope the information I presented helped you with all your buying decisions. Thanks for watching.